Yellowstone National Park. The year 2025 has officially begun, but instead of popping champagne, Yellowstone National Park, YNEP, is letting its geysers spew. On Tuesday, March 1st, YNP posted a photo of an erupting geyser on its Facebook page to mark the start of the new year. Instead of popping champagne, let's ring in the new year with a geyser eruption, the park wrote. Cheers to another year of amazing adventures. According to the U.S. Geological Survey, USGS, a geyser eruption occurs when groundwater heats up due to nearby hot rock and the pressure of the overlying rock breaking free, causing an eruption. While eruptions are relatively common in Yellowstone National Park, YNP, Excelsior Geyser was particularly active in the 1880s, according to the Yellowstone Volcano Observatory, YVO. Before the 2024 Black Diamond Pool eruption in the Biscuit Basin, Excelsior produced the largest well-observed hydrothermal eruption in the Front County area. Activity at Excelsior Geyser in the late 1800s ranged from geyser-like eruptions to hydrothermal explosions. Some events ejected small rock fragments, Pullen said, while others involved large chunks of rock and large plumes of material shooting high into the air. Pullen said the first major eruption is believed to have been witnessed in 1878, but in 1881 and 1882 well-observed eruptions shot material 30 to 110 meters, or 100 to 360 feet, into the air. Pullen said the interval between eruptions was only about an hour, and the eruptions could last for several minutes. The water discharge from these eruptions is so great that the flow of the Firehole River increases significantly when the geyser is active, and plumes from some eruptions can be seen as far as 160 kilometers, 100 miles, away as steam creates clouds, Pullen wrote. 